today's Food for Thought comes from the 81st Psalm, verses 13 through 16, which reads, Oh, that my people would listen to me, that Israel would walk in my ways. I would soon subdue their enemies and turn my hand against their adversaries. The haters of the Lord would pretend submission to him, but their fate would endure forever. He would have fed them also with the finest of wheat, and with honey from the rock I would have satisfied you. True faith is one that lives in total submission to the Lord. The Lord desires for a people that will listen to him and that will walk in his ways. But here's the problem. We have a nature of rebellion within us. We have a nature that rebels against submission as we desire to do whatever we want to do. Now the problem with this is that it causes us to rebel against the Lord. It causes us to rebel against his instructions. This is sin. When we choose to live in sin, when we choose to be obedient to sin, we are making a choice not to lean on the Lord. This is the worst decision that we can make in our lives. Why is choosing not to submit yourself to the Lord? Why is that the worst decision that you can make in your life? Well, it is because the Lord desires to subdue your enemies. He desires to turn his hand against your adversaries. God, I want you to understand, does not desire for you to toil in the world, nor does he desire for you to be overcome by all that stands against you. So why do we, why do we seem to desire those things for ourselves? Why do we choose not to live in submission to God? God, again, calls for us to be totally obedient to him. He calls for us to be of submissive faith. In our submission, the Lord says that he will feed us of the finest wheat and honey. He will, in other words, satisfy our souls. So if you truly desire to be satisfied in your soul today, I encourage you, resist sin, resist rebelling against God, and submit yourself to his instructions. Thank you.